Hey, I'm John Mann, and I'm going to show you how to pull the stud wells from a guitar. These are the things you'll need to do this. A roll of painter's tape, an X-Acto knife, the wrench, the bolt, and the two dowel pins that I provided with your kit. Here's a stud well and the bridge. So as you can see, I've already put the painter's tape on the guitar and I've already replaced one stud well on the bass side and we're going to do the other stud well. And you just follow along, it's quite easy and uh, no big deal. So the first thing you do after that is you take your X-Acto knife and score around the edge of the stud well. All the way around, you just want to cut in, into the finish if there's any, just as close as you can get to it. And this way, when you pull the well out, you won't chip the paint. So the first thing I do is I take the longer of the two dowel pins, there's two here, we drop the long one in the hole, take your metric bolt, in this case it's metric, screw it in till bottoms out and then use the Allen wrench and you'll see with very little pressure it'll crank up and in most cases it'll come out with just the one dowel if need be you pull the bolt out drop the other dowel pin in and do it and it'll pull the remainder thing out and presto there you go To install a new well, you put it in the hole, straight as you can, take a hammer and slightly tap it in. Notice I have the guitar flat down on the bench. You don't want to have it on the neck rest. And I just tap, 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 just making sure it goes in straight. You don't want to slam it hard, just light tapping. If you had a, a drill press, you can press it in, which always makes life easier. But this is for uh, bench top repairs. Now if I can get this bolt threaded in, I'm going to thread this in and just do it a little more so that it's just below the surface. There you go. Take some cleaner polish, clean off the tape residue, and you're good to go. It's that simple.